Um, uh, let's see. Uh, we have the usual collection of viewer changes in the pipeline. Um, most likely, next up is the notifications viewer. Uh, remains to be seen, of course, because we never decide these things until the last minute, but um, that's looking pretty good. Um, graphics, quick references, and HTTP um, the testing to date has found some problems that need to be addressed, which is what testing is for. Uh, and that's the next good thing. Um, but that means that we'll want another round for those. Um, Chrome Embedded Framework is getting some very good testing and should be getting fairly frequent updates uh, and is in pretty good shape. Um, Rift is not unfortunately getting any attention at the moment because people are working on other things. But uh, again, we hope to get back to that pretty soon. Um, and of course, there's always a batch of maintenance assorted bug fixes coming. Uh, so there'll likely be one of those out shortly. To, uh, uh, there were some minor regressions found in the, in the most recent viewer release. And so those are kind of getting fast track. Um, so that's, and then the, the other big news is not changing very much. A couple things that are happening soon. Uh, I don't have a date for you. I tried to get one, but we are going to throw the switch on the status RSS feed change. So it changes from RSS version 1 to version 2. A lot more detail in it, but uh, if you won't prepare to parse it, you'll, you'll be out of luck. Um, we do still have a viewer out there that's got uh, inventory changes, but that's behind HTTP um, in the change stream. So until the HTTP rewrite is out, that one won't be. Uh, and then after that, we'll be making simulator changes that are similar and begin deprecating support for some of the inventory APIs. Um, so watch for that over the next few months. Um, one of these. I, I, I've mentioned many times that um, as we try to make various services more robust, we're going to be adding more server-side checking for things that currently don't have enough. Um, one of the things we're going to be doing is uh, we're going to, so we're going to be improving some of the checking on um, uploads of various kinds of assets. Um, to make sure that they are what the Second Life ecosystem is supposed to cope with. Um, uh, so we will probably be doing things like to check that animations are really what they say they are, and um, meshes. We'll be adding some additional checking on meshes when they when they are uploaded, um, so that and and hopefully that will reduce the incidence of. Um, meshes being uploaded that then aren't rendered properly by everybody. Um, so uh, we'll we'll see, but we're we're going to try and beef up some of that uh, checking infrastructure. Um, Uh, let's see. Um, oh, and another one is attachment points. Um, right now, it turns out that uh, you can use attachment points that are not defined on the on the skeleton, and uh, they just get passed through to other viewers. And sometimes, if the if the other viewer doesn't know what to do with that attachment point, it just puts it at some random place, either at zero 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 or floating somewhere nearby or something. Um, that's that's not a good experience. Um, so we're going to be experimenting with changing them. Um, so if you 
if, if your viewer says attach this on attachment point, you know, 10,000, uh, we're going to remap it onto one of the existing real attachment points. And that's where it will, that's where the viewer will be told it. it's being attached. Do you know of any viewers specifically that do that? We, we do see um, invalid attachment point numbers in our logs quite a lot. Um, now the, there are some circumstances under which the viewer itself remaps things onto chest, but not always. Um, uh, but this is, where I'm talking about a simulator side change, so that as the, as the request to attach something goes through the simulator, it will be modified to be something that's a legitimate attachment. So I know that Firestorm used to do that for the bridge, right? And you changed that a few releases ago. Um, we were using a, 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 an out of range, I mean, it wasn't 10,000. I don't know what it was, 256 or something. Um, it was some, some other number. Um, and it may be that what we're seeing, you know, in the logs is, is old. Do you happen to know what that number was? Anybody? And 27. Yeah, that's a number I see a lot. So maybe what I'm seeing is mostly old versions of Firestorm or people copied what Firestorm did. So, yeah. So, uh, uh, could that could that be uh, just because <laughs> this sort of just came up again recently? Could that be related to that? Let me see what happens. No? Okay. Yeah, it's not loading for me, so I'll have to. But the um, so we will we will of course you know this change will go out through the usual incremental release process. At some point we will put a version of it up on a DD and we will let you know. And if people want to do checking about whether or not current or former versions of their viewers behave correctly. Okay, I just was throwing it out there in case it was. Enable upload of mesh weighted to attachment. You're not supposed to be weighting mesh to attachment points anyway. I'm pretty sure that was never supported on purpose. No, it, it wasn't. Um, Is that one and, of the... Uh, that's why I've told this user we're not bringing that back. Uh, Is that uh, one of the ch checks we're going to change here, or is that one of the changes we've uh, already I believe made? so, yeah. If that, oh, is it? will be checked on the back end uh, uh, as, as we add more of this uh, upload validation stuff. Oh, does that mean that all of this these people's content may also get broken? Uh, we're not currently looking at existing, we're not currently looking at modifying the existing content, it's more about uploading new content. Okay. Right. Right. That's, we're, that's we're good gonna, to know. Gonna check things that upload. So, um, it's, it's, with the goal of eventually having, you know, a larger percentage of the content in the world be something that fits what's exposed to. Well, I'll, I'll certainly attach the recording of this meeting to that Jira issue for that user as well. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, I feel bad for them. I don't like breaking... Well, it's not that we're breaking content. I, I don't like taking tools away from content creators, even if they weren't meant to be used in the way they're being used, but... Yeah. 
Yeah, but she does have a point too. I mean, secondary attachments was also a hack, but it did demonstrate to Linen Lab that people want more attachment points, and eventually Linen Lab did it, you know, properly. But I, I don't expect this would be uh, something uh, that you guys would do. I don't know. I have to run to another meeting in about three minutes, so I just wanted to interject that um, unless Whirly breaks it, uh, notifications is probably going to ship early next week. So this is your chance. We, we won't have that in our release. We're merged up to um, your maintenance, um, and that is going into final QA. Uh, today, in fact, so uh, we're locked down and we'll be releasing uh, a couple of weeks from now. That's great. Wait, what? A couple of weeks? Well, okay, a few weeks. That's better. <laughs> um, and, and you've merged all of the main releases? Yeah, uh, everything up to maintenance. And there, I'm not sure if there might be some cherry picks in there too. I don't know. I don't think so. Are there? Oh, right. A couple of things going into the line branch that are fixes for regressions that were introduced in the last thing. Okay, anyway, I think that's I think that's the news I had to discuss. Um, any other topics? Um, just to say that uh, we're in final QA and we're releasing with maintenance. That's about it from us. Really? 15 minutes after 12? We're no, no, we're not done. Oh, okay. good. Next, next Saturday, <laughs> ne next Saturday, October 31st, I'd like to uh, invite you all over to a Halloween party. Jessica oh, yes. will be doing a blog post about it. So uh, we're, we're doing our annual Halloween party. We've got uh, Mankind Tracer performing, then we've got Nance Brody performing, we've got the Trinity Shanghai sisters performing. Uh, then we're switching to live DJs, and when we switch to live DJs, we are launching a month-long hunt with nearly, probably by the time we're done, about 200 creators' gifts, and we're talking some really big, well-known content creators, um, and they will be around our gateway, which coincidentally, um, on the 31st at this party, we're also announcing the formal launch of the Firestorm Community Gateway project cool. and we'd love to see some lindens there and um even other viewers uh drake and cinder and and whoever else everybody is invited and encouraged well we'll have to see how the weekend plan shapes up but... later company uh it starts at 1 p.m so there'll be at least three hours of entertainment <laughs> And, uh, I'm sure they're not invited, Cinder, but I'm sure they'll attend. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody's welcome doesn't mean we won't send you home. Oh, did I say that out loud? Yeah, and hopefully we'll have a working uh, registration API. We did have one working. Until Whirly touched it. Yeah, we're we're trying to deal with that. We'll see. Yeah, I know. Goes. I'm I'm sending chocolates to Alexa. I wish it had last names. Uh, come on, folks. Jessica Lyons here, and it's not even twenty after, and we've run out of things to talk about. Come on. Things must be going pretty smoothly. We 
will also be um, probably when we do our next viewer release, we will be blocking a bunch of our older viewers. We've realized the other day that it's been a long time since we did that. So, um, we'll be moving the, moving the bar up a little bit. Yeah, we well, we move the bar up, and it's becoming <laughs> quite the support issue. <laughs> but uh, it's almost like release day all over. Now we we don't I don't think we plan to release the, the to uh, block the obsolete platforms. You if people want to keep limping along on that, and they can, they're welcome to. It's. It's unsupported. If it doesn't work, it's, we're very sorry. But we're not going to do anything about it. Basically, I, I, I'm sorry you're not allowed to drive your Model T on the uh, uh, throughway because it's not capable of doing 70 miles an hour. <laughs> right, exactly. Sorry, we're not going to drop the speed limit for you. <laughs> yeah. That's, that's more or less. <laughs> no, come on, Ryder. You're talking to a guy whose secondary machine here runs XP. <laughs> Me sad too, but uh, until I can afford a new uh, video capture card for it, you know, I'm stuck with that. So it is twelve nineteen. I I think we're done. I I think we're done. It's a shame <laughs> to be done on such a beautiful Friday afternoon right before a long weekend. Well, it's not a long weekend, but that was last weekend. Yes. It's going to be a long weekend for our support team, though. <laughs> but not in a good way. Uh, I heard that Jess is going to be pulling a couple shifts in support, a couple eight-hour shifts doing support yeah. in the English group today. Today, oh, by the way, Over the weekend. Uh, for those of you who weren't at the, support, the Firestorm support meeting, today I'm officially labeling the Hate Jessica Lion Day. <laughs> and uh, it seems everybody's really celebrating that today. <laughs> you should see my inbox. Fun times. We love blocking old versions. If you did it more often, maybe people would get used to it. I don't know about that. <laughs> if, if we did it more often, we wouldn't have a support team. It, it, it's amazing how much a, a single release covers. It, it's two weeks to a month. Oz, you have to give Paige um, your bear. Uh, oh. I'll keep an eye open for the email. All right. Okay, I'm off. I have, have a I great have weekend, a, everybody. Sorted fires to fight. So, if you'll excuse me. <laughs> Good luck putting out the fires and have a great weekend, us. Thank you, folks. See you there. Later.
Catch y'all later, folks. <laughs>